Hey guys, it's Nick. I got another little random battle here for you. I start off with a uh, Lander Asterian against his Mammoth Swine. I get an Intimidate off, which is awesome. I'm going to switch out into a Rotom Heat, expecting some Ice move. And he does good for the Icicle Crash, so he knows it's dangerous for him to be in there. So he switches out, and I go for my Overheat, which is actually really good for me against that Magmortar, because he had that uh, Hot Air Balloon thingy. And I don't really know why he goes for his Thunderbolt here, but... Uh, I'm just gonna let it go, and I'm gonna Volt Switch out, because my special attack is low. And I go into my Lander Asterian. He's gonna miss with a Will-O-Wisp, which is, uh, again, very good for me. And I'm gonna go for a Rock Posh, so I'm definitely faster than that Magmortar now. Sadly, he goes into this Masquerade, who intimidates me, and I go for the Earthquake, which kinda stinks. I'm gonna go for a Stone Edge, and get him down to 1%. Of course. He's gonna Hydro Pump me. I actually take that exceptionally well. I thought I wouldn't as much, but, you know. I'm going to go for the Stone Edge again and take him out. So he goes into his Mammoth Swine here. I'm just going to stay in and Stone Edge because I didn't really want anything to take this Icicle Crash. I guess I could have switched in the Rotom again. But I'm just going to have Landris get KO'd here. I'm going to go into my Rotom Heat now because it's safe switch. I'm going to go for the Overheat. <clears throat> He's going to go for the Icicle Crash again. Gets a crit, but I take it pretty well. I'm going to go for the Overheat again, and that's going to take out his Mammoth Swine. He's going to go out into a Gengar here, and I'm just going to switch out into my Swamper. So his Gengar is a Mega Gengar, of course, and he goes for the Shadow Ball. I'm going to take this opportunity because he's really not hurting me too bad and set up the Stealth Rocks. He missed with the Focus Blast too, which is actually very good for me. I'm going to go for the Shadow Ball here, and I'm going to go for the Waterfall to see how much it does. It does a decent chunk, not as much as I would like it to, because I can't really switch out because of that Shadow Tag. Anyway, he's going to go for the Focus Blast, and I'm just going to roar him, hopefully wanting to get that Magmortar, but an Ambipom comes out. So, I'm just going to stay in because I don't know what the Ambipom really will do, and he beats me up with a Power Up Punch, which kind of stinks. I'm going to go into my Deoxys Attack and kill him with the Super Power. Get those stat lowers. Yep. And he's going to send out his Gengar. I guess he thought he was maybe faster than me or something. Or I didn't have another attack. But I go for the T-Bolt. And that takes him out. Because I have the same attack and a special attack. He sends out his own Deoxys. And I didn't know how this thing was going to fare out against me. But I forgot about the superpower lowered. And he takes me out with a single extreme speed. I go out into my own Gengar here, and this was like a weird bulky set something or other. I don't really know, and I really didn't like it. And uh, he does kill me with a Psycho Boost. I go into my Lilligant here. His Ice Beam does a lot less than I thought. I was actually very surprised and happy with this Lilligant. I'm going to go for the Pedal Dance and take out that Deoxys Speed, which is awesome. All he has less is a Magmortar. I'm going to go for the Pedal Dance because I'm kind of locked into it, and it does actually... A pretty decent amount without any quiver dances or anything but he's gonna go for the fire blast and kill me so all i have left is my rotom heat and he's got a hope for a crit which he gets and i live so right here i'm gonna go for the rest because i'm a resto chesto and uh he forfeits here <laughs> so thanks for watching have a great day